So what you want to do here is you want to be real diverse when it comes to dodging things. You want to be able to jump up and down, especially for his laser beams. You want to be able to be very, you know, evasive when it comes to it. I suggest being either on, you know, top clouds, bottom clouds. Make sure there's elevation to jump up and make sure there's elevation to jump down just in case. When it comes to his fireballs, you know, they're not really difficult to dodge. All you have to do is just keep jumping over there and, you know, dashing. His tail can be kind of an inu uh, a nuisance. It's like I suggested. Being at the back, you could see his tail pretty easily. So I would suggest trying to be at the back of the... Damn, might be you guys. Of the clouds. Okay, so his second form, I highly suggest that you guys go ahead and switch to the homing missile uh, gu gun. It's extremely useful. People really hold it down. Uh, people really ignore this weapon for some reason. It's used for scenarios that you can't really attack the boss like this is now because I'd have to stop uh, I'd have to stop free aim and shoot down. So what you really want to do here is just keep shooting that and looking at those fireballs. You'll see that they'll lean away when they make that noise. See he leaned left so he's gonna run left. He leaned right so he's gonna run right. So you just literally jump up, pay attention to where they're going and then you jump down. This is the tricky part. This part is what makes this and breaks this part. I suggest using the charge beam. It's definitely easy. Uh, I use the the invincibility super to give myself a couple more seconds because he does a lot of damage here. His projectiles are extremely hard to dodge. So you know, it, if you're good at dodging, you don't really need that. But you know, if I if I were you, I would just you know don't use the homing be uh not the homing yeah don't use the homing beacon here. Just use the charge beam. Keep hitting him over and over again because that charge beam is going to do way more damage than that homing beam. You want this fight done as fast as possible. There you go. There's the dragon done. The infamous dragon. On to the next one.